All right. Hello. Welcome back to Spooktober. It's a uh, Davis Cube. You know, uh, we're going to be playing some Plants vs Zombies, and I made a new profile for this. He may or may not beat. Probably not beat this game, but uh, doing a new session, trying to get as many spoopy games as possible. You know how it is. All that nonsense. But we gotta go through the tutorial. This game is you collect sunlight, use plants, and make sure that. Uh, we're going to the tutorial, you'll see. Now, this is another PC game. I think I figured out the whole volume thing, and I'm trying to sync better because I, I realized I have a lot of sync issues. But I'm gonna try and figure it out. But yeah, so not gonna be too much to do. I'm gonna do a couple episodes of this and then move on. We do some other stuff today. You know, just more spooktober things. Oh god, okay. Final wave! We're about to beat the shit out of this game. Look at how easy this is. It gets harder, don't worry about it. I really like this game. You know, another game from my childhood. Yeah, give us that sunflower. Sunflowers are your best friend in this game. You need sunlight to plant these flowers, and this thing just produces it. And right now, someone's vacuuming. I hope you don't hear that, but I can't do anything about it. This is the only time I can record. So, you know. Oh, we now have three. Oh yeah, we know how important those are. But uh, yeah, so. This actually is a pretty fun game. It's something you can just lay back and relax while playing, you know, just anything. It's just a relaxing game, it's not high octane. You can get pretty stressful though, sometimes, if you when you play the harder mode. Now, what I like to have is two rows of sunflowers, that's how I do it. Yeah, it's just me personally, but whatever. Come on. Oh shit. Can I, can I get a sun for a please? Can I get a little bit of sun? So sun... Sunlight does drop automatically. But these things help. These things produce their own, so you don't gotta worry about it. Alright. Anyways, how are you all doing? Uh, oh, I cannot. I'll have to look it up, but for when I swap out games because I can't click off this right now, or I don't want to mess up the recording if I do, uh, before I, when I switch games because I'll be switching games, uh, I have to look up because we got a new subscriber. And that was cool, so I want to call him out, or not call him out, but shout him out. Because hey, someone's actually watching my shit, and that's fantastic for me. Huge wave of zombos. And there's not special, like, the zombies in later levels get, like, special abilities and shit, like something dig, something jump over stuff. These ones can't really do much but walk at you. Come on. It just pops open. And we just got cherry bombed. You can use those to blow up, uh, groups of enemies. I don't use that too much. Oh, so, okay, so the cone heads, they take more damage. That's what the cone heads are for, but I don't really use cherry bombs too much, or I try not to. It's just me, personally. But, uh, yeah. Uh, 
I don't know, there's a couple other games I want to play. Uh, today, at least. To get some more spoopy going on. Can you not, sir, please? We don't have my one of my favorite items in the game yet, the uh, Spud Bomb. Which just blows up one enemy, but it's actually really useful in how cheap it is. So yeah, you know. Uh, let's get another Sunflower going. Oh shit, I didn't even notice his ass down there. I need one more sunflower. And while that's going on, hold on. I gotta do something real quick. Give me a minute. Alright, I'm back. Forgot to set my timer. So I can get like a full sesh. We don't want me shirking responsible. Like that one time where I had to release like a fucking four minute video because I had to leave early. Kind of made me a little bit butthurt when I had to do that. Oh god, here comes the cone heads. So they take a little bit more damage, is their thing. Let's get two. Let's get two pea shooters working on that. So the, this game's mostly about, you know, like placement and strategy. And when it starts getting crazy when you get a lot more plants and more of these uh, special zombies. There we go. So anyway, how are you guys doing? Uh, not too much happened this week. I might be going to go see, uh, or the last week for me because I work weird hours. But I might be going to go see Adam's family this Sunday. That, that'll be cool. And I did go see the Joker movie and I loved it. Uh, so... Like the pumpkin moon thing for Terraria, I recorded a lot different than my last session last week. That was just a spur of the moment thing because I forgot I could just do that and I don't have to set anything up. But yeah, I did go see the. So I mentioned the Joker movie in that. I did go see the Joker movie, it was really good. Uh, it was a different superhero movie. There wasn't a lot of, you know, too much like. There was no CGI, there was no like battles for the world. It was just a slow and mostly subtle like look into the mind. Yeah fuck it. Hi. Yes. Hell yeah. So this is the wall. It's a shield. up all these zombies from getting to my house. Now we have the full garden. But uh, yeah, so yeah, it was actually a really good movie. There was some, I don't want to spoil anything, but there was some, there's a, uh, man, there was a lot going on in that movie. And it's very uncomfortable feeling with the movie, but I mean in the best way possible. When shit went down, you were more like, oh, God, like, I don't, I don't want to see that, like, I want no part of this, like, there were parts that were hard to watch, and I mean that in the best way possible. Yep, lose that arm. I like how, how did your pants rip like that, sir? You guys all come back from a convention or something? That's kinda what to say. Alright, so I need... Oh, that fucked me. Okay. I need one more. Thank you. Put another sunflower down. Uh, I like how they also can't, like, that probably, you'd probably die if they could swap pathways. Now I've gotta go down the grid. Uh, I'm confident. Probably shouldn't be, but I'm confident. No, I'm not so confident anymore. Take two! 
Two pea shooters for the price of one. I wish. Well, we we will be getting better stuff later. So. Oh, it took it did take two of them to fucking kill that guy. Yeah, they're just whittling him down. Oh, last sunflower needs to go down. Uh, put that right there. But yeah, I was actually really excited for that movie. Glad it came out, even though there was some... They are trying real hard to, to put that movie down. I mean, it's doing fantastic, and I love it. I don't know what's going on with all the Joker hate. I don't even call it hate. It's... I don't know what's going on with the Joker movie. They just keep saying, like... Oh, it's a dangerous threat. You realize it's a comic book movie, right? How much different from, like horror movies, you know? But we can still watch those. I don't know what's going on with this movie. I put that down on the wrong spot. Should be fine though. Okay. Then, uh... Then we're, I've been thinking more about, like, I've been waiting, because I did get a... I mentioned it, a DS capture card. So I can play Luigi's Mansion, probably not for Spooktober, but after I finish Metroid, or Super Metroid. If, if it comes in time for Spooktober, hell yeah, I'll do it, because then I'll do Luigi's Mansion 3 afterwards. I just don't want to do them too close together, is the problem. And with all the new games coming out, you know, like Pokemon and stuff, I want to do Pokemon. But, uh, yeah. There's some things that are out that I want to do. Bam, you know, I mean, and Monster House got fun. Now that lets you dig up a mistake. Yeah, that lets you get rid of a mistake. This is Crazy Dave. Not Crazy Dave. What? You can show us to dig up the plants, let the digging commence, okay? Just click on it and click on what you want to get rid of. Oh goody, now for the price. We're going bowling. Take this walnut. Why I put a walnut in your hand? Because I'm crazy. Oh, bowl me a winner. Okay. So, I think halfway through you get these like fun little mini games. And, uh, now the red ones blow up, so I want to save those, but I will use the normal one. With reckless Abandon. Nope, oh, two for the price of one, baby. Yeah! I'm gonna let you get a little close. Nice. Come on. I'll buy their, like, their challenges where they get faster and, oh, that gets stressful. Oh, I'm paying attention. Oops. Alright. Oh, I let you get too close. No! There we go. Oh, that could have got him. That's not fair. <laughs> I got one of them. There we go. Now that's a bounce. But yeah, these, these things can get hard. A huge wave of the fuckers. Final wave. I thought that would have hit more people, but fuck me, I guess. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I really would hate for. 
That's not gonna hit the other guy. God damn it. Now he's gonna get my brain. There we go. Blooming Doom Seeds. The Potato Mine. I love this item. It's one of my favorites. Okay. Let's start a new level, and the reason why I like the uh, Potato Mine so much, they're a one-time use, but they're extremely useful. Um... Oh, I think we have a little bit. Hold on a minute, I gotta check something. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we have some time. Uh, I'm gonna put this right here. So it takes some time for it to grow up, but it can be a very good way to temporarily deal with the lane. Like if you have one guy coming up and you're not ready to put any uh, shooters down, you can use that as like a temporary fix. While you're built, you're bolstering up your back forces. And look at the look at its little doofy face. I love the spud bombs. And they say 